In the early summer of 2023, the peak of one of the most active storm seasons in recent memory, I had a gambling problem. I couldn't stop betting on secondary targets away from all the crowds, and I kept winning big, so I kept playing big. And on June 23rd, I went all in. While most summertime storm chasers saw a few very photogenic tornadoes in Wyoming, I went against the grain to southeastern Colorado and saw this storm having already begun producing its first tornado, a 40 minute long shape shifting EF3, the strongest in this part of Colorado in over a decade. Chasing in the summertime isn't all about the tornadoes. This colorful spinning storm produced no tornadoes, but still put on quite a show. After dark, the same storm produced hundreds of red sprites as a derecho hammered Tulsa, Oklahoma, over 300 miles away. Part 1 of this video showcased the early spring, March, April, and May, and this part is documenting the summertime, that's June and July. Already, with just two storm chases in June, nature has managed to produce powerful blue supercells, massive shelf clouds, gigantic sprite lightning, and tornadoes as tall as several Empire State buildings stacked up on top of each other. But the video isn't over, so I guess there must be more. Dust storms and dusty tornadoes are common in the summer, but sometimes storms are better off letting the dust settle and showing off their weird shapes and colors across the open prairie. With every alien spaceship and flying saucer, summertime storm chasing gets a little bit weirder and more fun, but ultimately, the tall photogenic tornadoes still take the cake.
New Mexico in the summer is a great place to find a nicely structured supercell rolling aimlessly over open grassland prairie. Just remember to watch out for the local wildlife. Is a funnel cloud. In Colorado, the same can be true. Sometimes, daily supercells march off the mountains toward isolated canyons and sparsely populated farmland out in the eastern half of the state. This is looking awfully sharp for uh, just being a wall cloud. <clears throat> Losing branches off that tree. Yeah. It's like heavier right there than it is right here. <laughs> Love that. The summer of 2023 really knew how to put on a good show at sunset, even at home. But one sunset really made all the rest look bad. In total, I saw 24 incredible tornadoes in 2023, chased in nine states, and only lost one windshield to hail. And I had my most fun storm season to date. Thanks for watching. <laughs>